Hello everyone. Uh, today we uh, I'm going to show you how to connect to uh, Android mobile de device file system from Mac Mac OS X. So I'll be using Mac OS X 10.7 Mountain Lion, and I'll be connected to Android Ginger Bit 5.5, and this is my Android device. So. I'll be using US yes, uh, File Explorer and uh, I'll, use, I'll be using the Remote Manager by which I'll uh, activate the uh, hotspot uh, for FTP file server by which I'll be connecting from uh, Mac OS X to Android device. So you can install US yes, File Explorer from here or I can, I'll just show you from how to install it from Google Play. As you can see, it is already installed here. So uh, you can select this and install it on your computer. And now we will just move to our US File Explorer and show you how to configure the Remote Manager. So from here, I will just click on menu and from the menu, I will just scroll down and under the, uh, just a minute, you can see there are in the utility, uh, network, LAN, cloud, FTP and there is a utility called remote manager. You just select this and uh, while selecting this see uh, whatever network you have uh, uh, if you have uh, say Wi-Fi as I'm using a Wi-Fi router TP-Link uh, router and this has been connected to, to, to my Mac OS X as well as to my Android mobile and if you go to the settings you will find something here. So, okay, say there's a port, the port is 3721. You can use, uh, select any random port which is does not conflict with your existing port. And in the root directory, uh, suppose I select the just a moment, in the root directory it is SD card. You can just move back and select the root as the root directory. Suppose I select it and click on OK. Okay, whenever I connect to FTP server, uh, it uh, just uh, start from the root DIR is the root directory. Now, manage account and I'll, if you, I click on this, set manage account. Uh, here I will set a username. I set a username, say, nil. Okay. E -E L and my device is a bit slow that's creating a problem and in the password say I see give one two three okay so I have set the account here and let's scroll down and see anything else is there no there is nothing you can also create a shortcut on your desktop uh, on your I mean, sorry, sorry not desktop on your <coughs> Android uh, launch screen and that you can create a shortcut so I'll just move back and, and I click on turn on so when you click on turn on it is FTP 192.168.0.110 and port is 3721 now I shall minimize this and I'll just move to my Mac OS X close this one so now what we'll do we'll just go to the finder menu and click on go and select connect to server now into this uh, we'll just type here not 
SMB, it should be FTP. And in the address, I will set it to 110 and colon 3721. Let's add this for later use. Select this one and click on connect. Okay, so it's asking for a registered user and password. What I have said, you know, in WL, and the password is 123. You can set the remember password for future use and click on connect. Okay, we are done. Now, this is my. I'm not wasting much of your time, I'm just show you, going to show you something. Just a SD card, so let us open this one. And from here, what we will do, we will go to external SD and just select uh, any files. Uh, we will select this download, open this download, and copy this Android emulator and paste it here. So, this is how you can access your file system and write mobile file system and copy any kind of files okay just uh, depending on as I've shown you the current directory starting startup directory which you are setting for your remote manager so that is and the next thing is that if you uh, whenever you mount any network folder okay and you go to suppose you go to file and open a new finder window you will find that it is automatically mounted okay now when you click on it you can get the same stuff here okay so open it as I have opened it twice so two folders are showing it does not make any difference both are same and you can also access this uh, you can just select this list view and go to any of the folders say let us go to it where is the SD card? Yeah, SD card and into that. Just a moment, let's expand it. And we'll find external SD. Oh my god. Download. Okay, external SD and download. I've copied this so you can see okay so it's been mounted you can also click on this to unmount if you want to unmount this and that's all about Android tutorial on connecting to Android device from Mac OS 6 10.7 line mountain line so <coughs> so this is all about this so if you like this video please press the like button if you don't like it please also press the dislike button you can also subscribe to my channel that is a cb channel 190776 that's all for today thank you very much